Well, this topic is uh, hermaphroditism, hermaphrodite animals ki andar. Uh, jo, uh, ab, pehle to ye hume samajna hai ki what are hermaphrodite animals? Ye, ye wo animals hain jin ki andar, ek hi animal ki andar dono sexes. Yani ki dono animals jo hai, ek hi animal, it uh, have the ability to produce sperms as well as the eggs. Or this condition, this is uh, condition is, this condition is called hermaphroditism. So it is a it is a condition of having both male and female reproductive organs in the same individual. So hermaphroditic animals are mostly invertebrates such as worms, that is bryozoans, the trematodes, just the flukes aati hain, snails aati hain, slugs and barnacles. So ye vogue, it's a ye jaise ye sare ke sare jo hain ye invertebrates hi hain. Or ye mostly they are all they are aquatic. Mostly, yeah, they live in very moist conditions. Now, they are usually parasitic, they are slow moving or permanently attached to another animal or plant. So, ye un animals ki andar ye hermaphroditism hai. Or hermaphroditism is especially beneficial to sessile animals that occasionally encounter the opposite sex. Like in this diagram, in this photograph, mein rada, ye do earthworm hai. Okay, sessile to nahi hai, they are motile. So, at the time of, of uh, that is uh, production, they come very close together or dono jo individuals hai, they then exchange the sperms. That is, A or B hai, to A jo hai, wo B ke eggs ko fertilize kar raha hai or B kya, B jo individual hai, wo A eggs ko fertilize kar raha hai. To is tara, this is, uh, these are the animals which are said to be the hermaphrodites. Now another variation is ki andar ye ek isi hermaphroditism ki andar there is a variation which is said to be sequential hermaphroditism. This occurs when an animal is one sex during one phase of the life cycle and the opposite sex during another phase. In the early conditions ki andar wo ek sex hogi lekin later they change their sex into the other one. Or hermaphrodites are either uh, pro, uh, protogynous or uh, protandrous. So protogynous animals, they are born female. They are born female, but they change their sex. They become then male uh, later uh, at the time of maturity. Examples are uh, blue head, races, then, then rana and temporaria. Then there's uh, protandrous animals are males during their early life or yeah by birth like in later they become female or is may examples they are many fish they are like bulk uh, in certain cases they are uh, jo unki sex reversal reversal ki jati hai experimentally sex reversal ki jati yani male se female fishes banai jati hain taaki zyada se zyada egg production ho aur new individuals aur fish ki production badh jaye और इसके अंदर मोलस्क्स भी हैं और कस्टेशंस भी हैं ये जो आइडियाज हैं ये असल में नेचर से ही आइडियाज कलेक्ट किए जाते हैं एंड देन दे आर इंट्रोड्यूस्ड दैट इज एक्सपेरिमेंटली सो अ चेंज इन द सेक्स ऑफ अ पॉपुलेशन इन इज वन फैक्टर दैट कैन इंड्यूस सीक्वेंशियल हर्मोफ्रोडिटिज्म व्हिच इज कॉमन इन ऑस्टर्स अब ऑस्टर्स के अंदर भी Oysters jis ki andar phir ye these are mollusks to is ki andar ye introduce ki jati hai ye condition or uh, so that they may uh, uh, is kyunki bahut sare ye food production bhi hai ek lihaz se uh, oysters ki they are used as food so this is a hermaphroditism or is ki do types so this is all about